What's up, you fools? Matt is United, your favorite Eurovision channel. It's Sweden's turn, like their review. They rehearse for the second time, and Benjamin and Grosso's dance you off. Now, did he impress us or not? This was the second rehearsal. They've done it at Melody Festivaling. They're doing it now. What do you guys think? Uh, Sean? I'm worried this is going to be a really short video because I think we've already said everything that needs to be said about this song. But it was another free, do it anyway. Yeah, it was another another free good performances from Benjamin today. He's uh, he's really got this nailed down, and obviously he's had his melody festival and performances and his rehearsals. He's he's probably sick to death of this song and this performance <laughs> by now. But you know he's got to do it a couple more times if he wants to get to the Eurovision final and do well. So, but it's uh, you know it's a great light show. Uh, I like what Sweden have done this year. Um, I'm actually surprised how quickly they can set this up. Because I thought, oh god, this yeah, is going to yeah. take forever. Because it looks massive, but when you look at it on screen and in, in the arena, it's not actually too big, so it's not a problem. Um, but yeah, he's got good vocals. He really suits this song, uh, and the staging really suits this song as well. Uh, and I, I, I like what they're doing here. I don't think there's going to be any questions about this one, really, because you know Sweden have just done it again. Yeah. I don't know what really to add else, but we have to do a review anyway, because that's how we do it here. Um, he is very consistent. Um, I feel the sound today was slightly better, because in the first run through, I felt as it didn't match quite well with the backup vocalists. But now I feel like they found the right mixing. There's a little detail that I picked up on earlier. That's the biggest thing. Other than that, move wise, color wise, camera angle wise, it seems as we're done, we're good to go. And yes, he's been doing it since Melody Festival. And, and um, it's, I don't know what else to add. I think this one is just good to go. I was at uh, Melody Festival and I saw him winning there. We have interviews with him. I met him again at London Eurovision Party, saw him perform on a table-sized stage. <laughs> he could even perform on a table-sized stage. Mm -hmm. And I thought, wow, this is actually impressive. When you can go with this big show this lightning and everything and just almost be standing on the table performing and do the same performance mm -hmm. and um, he's he is someone he is you could be a bit jealous you could envy him a bit he's I mean he's got everything he's got the whole package he's good-looking um, he's such a lovely nice guy inside out and he knows this game and for me I, I, yeah I can only say this is one of the best performers this year um, live he's very good as well so you know, it's, yeah, a, it's yeah. a pretty straightforward. Yeah. So I guess we're just going to do this really quick and see, you know, if Sweden going to qualify or not. Listen to your gut right now after this particular rehearsal. I'll go first. I mean, once again, you saw my videos. I'm not a fan of the song itself. It's, you know, the sound of it doesn't jive with me. But you got to be objective. You got to look at it, look at the staging, look at the odds. I'm like, of course Sweden is going to qualify. It's a strong yes for me. Hello. I don't need to, like, support a song. Uh, not support, like, like mm. uh, connect, connect with a song for me to acknowledge that. So strong yes from me so how about you Sean this has got non-qualifier written all over it I mean come on there's not even a question with this is there it's a, it's a cool chart friendly hit he performs it very well he's a great performer and I think if he plays his cards right with this Eurovision he could have a very big career ahead of him oh. depends yeah depends how well uh, the rest of Europe will take to it but no this is going to sail through to the final all right Chris I think I know your answer it's a big yes I mean I can't I can't let this one go uh, I think He's yeah, he's got the whole package and uh, he's ready for the final. I also think that when when people are being so harsh, I I don't see it. I, and this is when people are writing, oh, you just like it because it's Sweden. It has nothing to do with the country. This mm -hmm. is something to do with the song. He delivers the song. I believe in him. And yeah, it's I, I don't care about the countries. Honestly, I care about the song and the artist and what's not to like. Yes. There we have it. Three strong yeses from us. I think that doesn't come as a surprise, but we want to hear, do you think we're overrating, overreacting? This actually may not go through, or do you think this could win even? Let us know. Leave your thoughts below in the comment section. We're moving on soon because um, Montenegro is rehearsing next, right? So see you all soon for that one.